Hey everyone, welcome back to the vlog series that's highlighting our field experience throughout the semester. So last week I kind of talked to you guys about the pride model of practice trainings that we are supplying to foster care and adoption agencies, you know, throughout the United States, but in particular last week's was um, in the New England area of the United States. So this week we've really focused on kind of figuring out projects and assignments that I'm going to be responsible for for the rest of the semester. So I'm pretty excited about that. Um, you know, we kind of jumped in full force with meetings and trainings, and now we kind of have a second to reflect on those trainings and also just kind of get busy with different projects and stuff like that. Of course, there are more trainings to come, but right now we have a little bit of a break from those. Um, so right now, currently, I'm working on updating statistics in our Pride book. So the Pride book, what that is, is it's a book that really outlines every single step of the Pride model of practice that we facilitate um, to those foster care and adoption agencies across the country. So in the towards the end of that book, the Pride book, there are some statistics around foster child or like children's safety that you know that the foster parents or prospective foster parents need to be aware of in their homes whether it's pet safety sleep safety water safety and stuff of that nature so some of those statistics are outdated and unfortunately the numbers have risen since this book was created so i'm actually in the process of updating those statistics i'm pretty excited about that i enjoy updating statistics and you know researching things and stuff of that nature and so, like I said, I'm currently doing that. And then another thing that I will begin on shortly is helping out with some child welfare policy that um, CWLA is currently in the process of creating and also presenting to Capitol Hill to different members of Congress um, and stuff like that. So I'm really excited to be working on that and helping out with that. I'm actually currently in advanced policy um, with Carol Phelps. It has all of our DC students um, that are interning in DC. And we've really been doing a lot of, um, you know, research on policy and creating like policy fact sheets and stuff like that. So I, like I said, I am really excited about the opportunity to help out CWLA with this child welfare policy. Um, and my policy class, you know, through UA and the School of Social Work is definitely helping out with that a lot. So that's kind of currently where we're at. That's what we're doing. We're still kind of adjusting to the virtual platform of my internship. You know, not being able to be there in person kind of comes with its own set of challenges, but we're definitely working through it. And I'm super excited to see what the rest of the semester has to offer. So I hope you guys continue to follow along and I will see you in next week's vlog. Thanks. Bye.